Hey guys, welcome back to another Vlogmas. I didn't know what to vlog today, you guys. I spent all day at my parents. I was helping my mom with some paperwork. So, um, it took basically all of my day. So I just figured I would just unbox some of my PR packages. I don't have as many as I did last time. I have four boxes so I can thoroughly um, show you guys exactly what's in each box. I feel like last time I kind of rushed it because I'd, I was so backed up that I had so many and this time I can go through them and I didn't know what else I could vlog. So here I am giving you guys an unboxing video. Um, I'm still sick. Still sick. I'm waiting for um, this to go away. But as of now, I just gotta be patient and I guess deal with my voice right now. I do have a lot of things coming up, so I do hope that I can pre record that way. I'm not just uploading as late as I have been uploading um, my all of my vlogmas. I feel like I've been all day late or I just upload really late, so I do apologize for that. I will try to get my shit together, it's just hard, but. Uh, yeah, so today's video is going to be just me unboxing my PR packages that I've got in um, recently. I'm going to start, I guess, with ColourPop. By the way, I threw in my lippy scrub in here uh, just because I had mentioned to you guys before that my lips were super, super chapped for a while. Like, literally, I would be able to peel off, like, a big chunk of the skin for my lip because of how chapped they were so someone uh, messaged me uh, or commented on one of my videos to stop using the EOS or EOS I don't know how do you how you say that it's like the ball um, chapsticks I would I had been using them for like ever and then uh, I didn't see no results and I would load up on it at night because of how chapped my lips were and I would thought that I'd wake up with them moisturized at least but um, nope they it wasn't working at all I feel like it was actually making it worse, worse so someone actually commented on one of my videos that when they were using it it made their their lips actually worse so I was just trying to think what have I been doing different from when my lips started getting chapped and I actually wanted to blame it on my injections. Um, as many of you guys know, I do get uh, lip injections. I've been doing it for the past, uh, I want to say, four or five years. I don't know if it's been longer. I want to say it's about five years. And I was blaming it on that. I was like, maybe, I don't know, the product is drying up my lips. I don't know. But I was like, why did it start all of a sudden? You know, I was doing fine before. So the only thing I could think of that I had done, that I had added differently was that chapstick and, or not a stick, it's not a stick, but the little EOS, whatever. Um, so it wasn't working for me and I switched it up and I actually, since they sent, they had sent me in one of their packages, their lippy scrub, I used to, uh, exfoliate my lips with literally and if you don't want to buy this you could try that too i i was doing this i've been doing this for like ever and it helps i literally just with my toothbrush brush my teeth i mean not my teeth my lips and um i wet the toothbrush and then i brush them gently and then i get one of the towels i have like the rough kind of just basically a regular um bath towel but i use i normally would use like the little ones and i would um kind of roughly go around the lips so I could take off all the dead skin that I had just scrubbed off. So that's a tip. I think I've gave this tip before on one of my old videos, but I haven't mentioned it before since then. Um, and they actually came out with a lip, lippy scrub, which I've been using to rub off all the dead skin, and it comes with a chapstick. So I actually feel my lips a lot better. There's days that I still have them a little bit chapped, but nothing like how they were at that time that I had filmed that video where I mentioned that my lips were um, doing super bad, but anyway, so I just wanted to bring that up. It's from ColourPop, the lippy scrub, and the lip balm. I don't know if you'll be able to see, but that's it. And then the lippy balm, it's right backwards, but these have been heaven for me lately. And this PR package came three items. And by the way, you guys, I do have a discount code with ColourPop. It is 5 Judith. If you guys would like to use it, you do get $5 off. I know there's certain things that you can get the $5 off um, with, but 
um, a lot of the things you should be able to. So it came with a mascara bundle, I guess. It's called Flutter About BFF Bundle. So I do have a lot of their mascaras. They do send me a lot of these. Um, I got a black one, which is called Black No Black. Which is actually the one I'm wearing uh, right now. I was starting to run out. So thank God they sent me another one. And then um, this one is a purple one. It looks kind of like violet. And it's plum. And get it. Let's see if you guys can kind of see the, the tone. I lo actually love their mascaras. Um, I do have all the colorful ones. So I do like when I'm trying to add a pop of color. It just I don't. Um, add them to the top lashes the colorful ones just because I like to wear uh, my falsies a lot but I do like to add it on the bottom lashes just to give myself a different eye look so I came with the mascara bundle and some plumping glosses it's a bundle as well and in I have let's see They have the name she's oh she's here this one is she's here and then viceroy Hopefully my face is not like... that's viceroy let me see i should try one for you guys i'll try she's here because it looks more of a nude actually really cute I do like to use lip um, a lip liner to give it more of a shade since most of the glosses end up being more of a see-through this tone that way they look it gives it more of a nude tone so I do like to outline it first with a, li a lip liner and then put the lip gloss whenever I do lip gloss just an FYI but this is what it looks like hopefully I didn't like put it on stupid because I can't really see but it's freaking cute then I have a flutter pressed powder palette so eyeshadows Ooh, these are cute I love these colors I love that they always at least include one or two um, glittery ones so there you have it super cute I'm really digging this these bottom shades right here freaking cute i thought this was gonna be a super short video and i've been talking for like ever it's okay i'll go back and edit it Ooh, this is cute your gold baby solid gold their packaging is always freaking cute too they always have like a theme to whatever they send and our newest collection is Ultra Clam Lux. It comes with a good ass gold palette, metallic liquid liner, and Lux lipstick kits. Cute. Ooh, they threw in some eyelashes too. Falsies box lashes. Or some other ones. Honey. They're called Honey. I didn't even say the name from the other one. These are minx. Minx. Their lashes, I feel like, are more like natural looks. Like, they're not that bam, you know, full on lashes. Let's see, they're good as gold. Palette. Mm -mm -mm. Freaking cute. So, this is the good as gold pressed powder palette. Super cute tones. And they're like. The gold ones are always freaking cute. Look at this. Ah, that's too much. I think I went too hard on that one, but look at their super gold tones. Freaking cute. Sorry, I hope my nails are not dirty <laughs> under there. And then I guess it's just the lipsticks and the metallic liners eyeliners so it comes with two metallic eyeliners and it's in the rose standard and gold rush hopefully it doesn't look that bad 
but I guess this will do. Bottom is Gold Rush and the top one is the Rose Tone color. Look at that. Beauty. I love it. I love it. I love it. Their lipsticks. I freaking love. Ooh, this is... It's called the Have Expender. That's me. <laughs> it's a red lippy. Oh, and it comes with a, a lip liner as well, which is perfect because I feel like sometimes it's hard to match your lipsticks with lip liners. Red. Ooh, that's cute. And that's freaking gorgeous. Look at that. It's a beautiful red. I'm not the greatest with my swatches, you guys, so don't, don't judge me. Let's see what the next one is. Ooh, it looks like a nude. Strike It Rich. This is called Strike It Rich. So the red one, by the way, is called, again, Hey Big Spender. And then this kind of nude one is, what was it again? Strike It Rich. So... I'm definitely going to be trying this one. Oh my god. You guys know I love wearing nude lipsticks. Love, love, love. Focus. Oh my god. You guys. I'm going to have to try this one right now because it's freaking gorgeous. So, let me put the lip liner on. You guys, I am loving this. Let me get closer so you guys can see what it looks like. Super cute. Just kidding. Those are not the names. <laughs> the Hape Expender is the red one. And I don't know if that's what the bundle is called. But the lipstick, the red lipstick is Million Dollar Baby. And the lippy pencil is called Hot Cakes. You can see it on there. And the more of the nude kind of peachy one, I guess. I want to say it has kind of like that peachy brown tone. I don't know. Um, Strike It Rich. And then... I don't know if that's the name of the bundle. And then it's Simon Says for the lipstick. And Minute Man for the lippy. The, I mean, yeah, the lippy pencil. Minute Man. I really love this one though, you guys. I love it. And if you guys don't like cream um, lipsticks, uh, if you guys do love more of the matte look like myself, you can always dab it with some, uh, what is it called? It's at the tip of my tongue. Um, the setting powder. There you go. Oh my god. The setting powder. Just dab it and then you're good to go. You are good to go. Kind of like lightly. Don't overdo it either. I think that's it, right? Yeah, I just came with those two lipsticks. I'm going to go through the Araceli Beauty uh, box, which I love. She always sends the cutest things. She actually um, likes to come up with all her packaging uh, based off of where she comes from and her family. I know her lashes are named after her sisters. And then um, this one, I know I saw her posting a lot about it. She came out with an Azteca theme and oh my God, so cute. Okay, so I haven't opened this one at all. I'm freaking excited. So this is the Azteca Eyes eyeshadow palette. Oh my god, it's gorgeous! I'm really digging the black one right here. It kind of has like the shimmery gold. I don't know if you could tell on the camera, but it has like a gold shimmery, like glitter tone to it. Go show her some love. I'll, I'll tag her Instagram page there. If you don't follow her yet, you must. What's this? Some earrings that's freaking cute oh 
that's amazing. I love it. These are actually really cute. I'm excited. I'm excited to wear them. And then I have my boxy charm, which I haven't opened either. And for this one, I'll go ahead and provide a link for you guys if you guys want to subscribe to um, Boxy Charm. If you're not familiar with it, you pay a, a monthly fee and then they'll send you um, a box monthly with products um, that you can try. And they're actually full size products. Like, I know on one of them, I got a dose of Colors lipstick, and I have it right here. It's freaking beautiful, and it's actually, like, full size, you guys. Look. It is... I haven't tried it, because I just opened it the other day, too. But it's super red. And I love dose of Colors uh, lipstick, so I was so happy to actually get this one the boxy charm i'll go ahead and provide a link down below if you guys want to subscribe storybook cosmetics so it comes with a fairy tale storybook cosmetic Ooh, this is cute oh this is such a cute packaging so it comes it's a, actually let me block this so the light doesn't reflect but it's an eyeshadow palette with cute tones this is so creative it made it look like a a book and then it comes with lip exfoliator with radish extract oh and it's vegan I know all of ColourPop uh, products are uh, vegan cruelty free so I love to see that because I am plant-based and although I didn't go in it because of the animals I did it more for health reasons um, I am starting to learn more about that about animal cruelty and I get excited when I see things like that. But it comes, it comes with a lip exfoliator, which I should try since I was just talking about how my lips get chapped pretty often. And then it comes with rose face oil, soothing face oil for fine lines and wrinkles. Ooh, I think they know that I'm, I'm close to turning 30 soon. I mean, maybe I should start using this. So this is the little bottle comes with the soothing facial oil formulated with organic english rose oleo extract rose ship seed oil warming water kelp and padina pavonica intensely nourishes the skin while smoothing the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles for all skin types including sensitive skin well i have sensitive skin so i guess i could be using and it's anti-aging I think I'm at that age where I need to start looking into these things because I don't use anything right now to help my skin and I'm getting at that age where I should start looking into it. Then this is Illuminating Blusher. True Brow Makeover Kit. Okay. So, oh, this is pretty cool. So, it's a brow bar. Oh, I just spit. Sorry. Brow bar by Rima. I think that's what it says. True brow, brow makeover kit. So, this is how it comes. It comes with the little brow bar. I mean, with the little... I'm assuming this is the gel to, like, um, keep your eyebrows together. Yeah. So this you put it at the end that way it's it works like a gel so that your eyebrows the 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 hairs the little hair stay in place and it comes with the little brush as well got some lipstick on right, well i'm done with all the unboxing that pretty much sums up uh tonight's video so i hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll see you guys on the next one love you guys